Good evening guys. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Sumaya. In this video, we are going to learn the use of cutout tool. Generally, we use cutout tool to make niches like this or you can have a skylight effect. So this is my sample project. Okay. Um, first, I'll just, I'll just cancel calculation. Now to use cutout tool, you can find the cutout tool here select this one so you can have rectangular cutout circular cutout or polygonal cutout so this too you can see once i select the cutout tool this has been turned into green in color it means that i have used my cutout here so let me make one uh, storage area here with this cutout tool we can have rectangular cutout just select your first point, second point and define the height. So you can see that when I use this cutout tool, it is cutting the whole wall. So you can see here, it is cutting the whole wall. I don't want it to be cut fully. So what I can do is select this cutout tool, go to the plan view you can see this is the area i have cut so it is cut and it is completely open so to close it or to have a minimum depth check here limit cutting depth and you can just decrease the depth of cut see point to fan now you can see my wall is visible this here this one so you can uh, use this measure tool and check your wall thickness so it is 0.45 so you can cut up to 0.45 let's go if you want to increase the depth click here select this and you can increase to point let me keep only 0.4 yes here you can do the same for circular cutout like this limit cutting depth and point four so you can have this rectangular cutout or circular cutout to delete any of the point you can just click here and then press delete select delete and you can add some texture so here it is the other you can use cut cutout tool only for the construction elements you can't use it on the objects like cube and doll if you like this video give it a thumbs up and stay tuned to explore more in dialogues with me thank you